Hey, welcome back to Twin Cities Live on this fine Wednesday. So behind the players in the NFL, there's a whole team of their biggest fans on and off the field. That's right. So today we're joined by two women who are showcasing their new clothing line and talking about what it's like to be a Vikings fan nonstop. So Leah O'Connell is the wife of Kevin O'Connell. He's the Vikings head coach. And Chelsea Adolfa Mensa is the wife of Vikings general manager, Kwesi Adolfa Mensa. And they're both here in studio with us. Oh, Hello, ladies. So nice to meet you. Yeah, thanks for having us. We're excited that you're here. Okay, we've got to talk about the clothing line because I think I am loving this trend of like great merch when it comes to any pro team and especially just this evolution of looking at it as it was always like boxy t-shirts for guys yeah. and then we had to wake up and go guess what everybody might want to dress cool on game day so how did you think about doing this Leah did you guys have a conversation that there was something missing it's funny you bring that up because that was one thing that we recognized was um, just the uh, different options of silhouettes that are out there and kind of the, the timeline or the trend over the last 20 years of different fan wear. Um, one of our goals was to bring new silhouettes to um, Minnesota Vikings especially, but yeah. Yeah. yeah so we, we had three different jackets, the denim, um, the starter, and then the shearling, and we wanted to bring kind of blend uh, streetwear, London streetwear with New York fashion and bring it to Minnesota. So. Oh, oh my gosh. So how did you guys uh, decide on the outerwear only and not like, you know, maybe just a base layer, but just why these three piece, pieces, Chelsea? So a lot of the London Vikings International Collection was inspired by the fact that we were playing internationally this right. year. Mm -hmm. And so the NFL has invested heavily, right, on these games that are being played at an international stage. And we feel like there's great opportunity Opportunity to better you know outfit the fans whether you're traveling internationally or you're in the Twin Cities or you live outside of the state but you're a fan of the Vikings um, and just be able to deliver them something that they can wear both on game day but then also just kind of in the streets of the Twin Cities and rock it. Yeah, I yeah. think that part is really fun about it too because it makes it a more versatile piece of your wardrobe if you're going to wear it to things, you know, like not everybody's going to every single game, right? right? No. I mean, it's fun to be able to have a jacket that you can wear out and about. And especially for you two, I mean, you know, you can rep it without have it being like, solid purple yeah, yeah. everywhere you go. Yeah, that was as much as we kind of the purple. goal. Yeah, yeah we love <laughs> right. yeah. yeah. A little less loud, a little more like if you know if you know, like does that say Vikings? Oh, it does. And then it's like a new silhouette to your point, something that you can wear just yeah. kind of out. I think subtlety kind of wins Super with everything. Yeah. I mean, you know, we're not doing like the Von Dutch thing anymore, oh. you know? <laughs> I mean, love Von Dutch right, though. Right. Iconic moment. Iconic right. moment, right? It had its time and yes. moment, but you know, not everything needs to be splattered all over hats and shirts and jackets. It's so fun. Have, are they available? Have they? Because they sold out fast. I mean, people were like chomping at the bit to get these. Yes, we did sell out quickly online for our online inventory, but they wanted to save some of the inventory for game day experience. So in the stadium shop, um, and then also I believe in Egan at the team store. Oh, good. Some okay. Select sizes. So there's still available. some still sizes, some. Okay. depending on you know the jacket that you're looking for and the size. But I think a lot, like one of the the aspects that has been so cool, I think is the reaction of the Vikings fan base to this concept that streetwear can come together with fan wear. Mm -hmm. And especially, like, we had some folks reach out who are local artists in the Twin Cities who are like, hey, like, can you give me a jacket? I want to paint on it. Sweet. And, you know, and I think yeah. that the, the fusion of athlete that we're seeing with artists yeah. is something that is sought after by fans. And these invest these investments of like this means something this artist in the twin cities who i love came together with this piece like that's kind of the evolution that we're seeing i know we talked a little bit about yeah. trends and yeah. you know moving away from like the pink and baby blue to represent you know the the fan base for women specifically we yeah. can move to more like versatile like colors and silhouettes to leah's point that's and this yeah. was a unisex um line yes so it was supposed to be and yeah. is for both men and women. Oh, you're okay. going to need to, like, up the production here, yeah. friends. Like, <laughs> Well, I know. So, yeah. yeah, so what's the next step then yeah. after all this? We, our goal was um, complete sell-through rate for this collection and then kind of go back to the drawing board and just, you know, tweak little things here and there. But it's definitely on the forefront of our minds. Of And then, okay, I have to imagine your husbands were super supportive. I mean, they were like, let's get after it. Because probably nobody knows the brand better than you because you hear about it all the time. 
Yes. <laughs> I just the, the face that you just got was yeah. how locked in you know our husbands are on the what's yeah. happening on the field. Right. Yes. Right. And um, you know I'll speak for myself, but my husband knows you know there's the athlete he's married to, but also the artist, and then. Uh, you know, we were parents to a toddler. We have one on the way coming in December. Yay. And then, um, you know, I also work at Google on the YouTube TV team. And so we, we are versatile women and mothers, and our husbands understand that. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Sure. yeah. Okay, so before we get out of here, I want to ask you guys just a couple questions like game day. You know, we mentioned the stadium a little bit. Like, what do you guys do? Do you guys have, like, any superstitions? Do you have any routines for a Sunday or a game day? Chelsea, you're saying no, oh not God. at all. No, I'm not a superstitious yeah. person. I would agree. Like, I was raised by an MD who said proper pre preparation prevents poor performance. Yeah, yeah. that's great. <laughs> I know, we're it's live on TV. <laughs> yeah. So, um, no, no superstitions. Routine-wise, uh, love, okay, food. Let's talk food. Yes. Mm -hmm. Copperfield, Copperfield, okay. mad love for Copperfield. Yes. Um, <laughs> Great breakfast. I just went there for brunch with some girlfriends. Great brunch. Yes. So yes, that is routine. Great food. Prepare for game day. <laughs> yes. You have to. You got to fuel up to get ready to watch. Yes. Right. That's right. That's okay. Right. We um, same same kind of deal. We're not we're not superstitious at all. Um, but we do get up. It's very uh, the action packed morning. We typically are hosting many friends and family. Gladly, it's so special to have them carve out time to come be with us and. Mm -hmm support us and so we usually load up and um, uh, ride to the stadium and then we get to see Kevin on the sideline before he gets going and just kind of let him know hey we're there we got you back and we're ready to we're ready to cheer, shake the walls in this place. That's so. awesome. Yeah, so fun. Thank you guys so much. Congrats on everything. I yeah. know. Oh, oh and so it's so exciting. This new baby's going to come. Oh, my gosh. Excited. Yeah, we're, we're, we're only two down. You know, uh, we're, I don't know if we'll get to four. But yeah, yeah, but you know what? The more the merrier. Yes. Yeah. 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 I think that's really great. Well, I hope it all goes great for you. Thank you, guys. Yeah. All right. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much. All right, you guys can find their merch this game or on game day uh, this Sunday at U.S. Bank Stadium store. There are some select sizes and pieces left. You can also find Vikings merch on all our website, we set up a link for you guys on TwinCitiesLive.com. Next year, they're going to have to make twice as much. Oh, for sure.